We're here at Comic Con 2015. I'm here with Paul Amos uh, from Lost Girl and also from Assassin's Creed. Yes. Paul, thank you very much for speaking with us today. Yeah. How are you enjoying uh, Comic Con? Well, my, my thighs are a bit stiff at the moment because uh, I got challenged by uh, Victoria Atkin, who does uh, plays Evie, which is my twin sister in the game. Uh, she's one of the first uh, playable assassins from the main franchise. Um, and I had to run the course against her. How'd you do? I set the course record. Really? Yep. Legitimately. What was, so what is the course record? It was 38.7. I did it in 36 point whatever. But the guy who created the course then went up after me and did it in like 28.9 or something. But you it doesn't count. He it, created the goddamn thing. You didn't suit up in the whole garb though for for the course. Do you think that would have oh, slowed you down? I was in my down? Rooks t-shirt. This, uh, you know, I was there. It was good. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't do a full assassin. Yeah. No, I just. Uh, that's next time, right? Had a nice fashionable t-shirt. Yeah. So let's talk about your current projects. We've got Assassin's Creed. Is there anything else you're working on right now? No, Assassin's is like a uh, full pedal to the metal to get that done. We, um, well, because we did the full mocap uh, and voice, so we worked on that from. January right through until I got to go back and do a full week next week and a full week the following week we do ADR voiceover and we're doing lots of marketing so it's like it's a bit of a full-time job at the moment so uh, we go ahead and do uh, I'm gonna do Captain Canuck season 2 which is a comic book webisode that we do uh, with uh, Tatiana Maslany from Orphan Black and Laura Vandervoort from Bitten and uh, Chris from the show as well in law school uh, I think we there's talk of like some really couple of big people coming in on that one so I'll do that in August as well um, probably do a theater show with oh, yeah? uh, with a bunch of cast mates um, with Zoe Palmer uh, a couple of other people Cass and Val pay maybe as well from the expanse he's one of the new leads in the expanse so we're thinking of maybe doing Macbeth next April in Toronto so I've got a bunch of different things and then maybe you know get a new show and yeah move on cool yeah. Well, talk about the motion capture work. Is this the first time you've done motion capture? Yes, it is. How um, was that experience? Well, I did the TGF, uh, which is a, like a pilot for a video game in 2013 in December. Um, and I didn't hear anything. Um, and then uh, then I met the director because they rejigged their creative. And then I didn't hear anything. And then I got a random call in August at 9 p.m. to come in the next morning at 9 a.m. 15 pages, learned it, went in, didn't hear anything. Went on our family holiday deep down in Mexico. Will you please come to screen test for Assassin's Creed in London, UK? And I was like, oh yeah, great. So I took three flights back, flew over to London, flew back to Toronto. Next day, can you come to LA in two hours time? And I'm like, yeah, I could do that. Flew to LA, flew back, went to a con in Winnipeg for Lost Girl, flew back. And I finally got the message that said, hey, you're the guy. So. Yeah. And it's a big franchise. It's a very well-known video game franchise. Yes. How does it feel joining this group? It's awesome. I think uh, I think they had some issues with Unity in the last one, which was largely because it was a new gen. Um, so they did that, and I feel like they're really trying to fix this one. That it's everything it says that this one's going to be awesome. They've had lots of tests, and people are really happy with it. Um, they've added a new bunch of things with the rocket launcher and uh, female playable character. The storyline's great and the setting's in industrial England. So it's like, couldn't be better. Awesome. Yeah. Anything else you're excited to see at Comic-Con, do at Comic-Con, experience at Comic-Con? Uh, I haven't had much chance to at the moment. Like I just did the AC course, but I don't think I'm going to have too much time. Um, you know, I've got friends doing different things and we've been to a bunch of parties and they've been cool. but. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not going anywhere near Hall H. No, no, that mayhem. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for your time. Stay tuned for more coverage of Comic-Con at ComicsOnline.com. Thank you again.